Hi everybody, it's uh, Chris Odra again and uh, I'm here today with Julian to take a look at uh, an interesting piece of kit called uh, Ryzen. Now Ryzen is an all-in-one uh, software and hardware combination uh, that runs on a custom operating system. It runs uh, its own custom sequencer and sampler and pattern editor uh, and uh, Julian's going to give us a little bit of information about the background of the project. Yes, hello. Then I'm Julian, nice to meet you. Uh, the thing is, uh, we are really in front of a new kind of machine because it's a VST standalone sequence, so you can use uh, all your VST plugins. By the way, we have already some plugins inserted in it, a, plugin, a bundle of 15 plugins, including 909, 908, Lindrums, ODT, GeForce. Uh, then what we will see today is uh, how to use um, the Ryzen as a DJ. Then you would see that it's possible to mix two projects at the same time. And to finish, we will see together that it's possible to use Ableton Live at the same time and install it in the machine directly. Okay, excellent. So uh, let's get to it. So in that arrangement, we have actually uh, uh, just three or five instruments. We have one line drum, one FM8 from native, one massive and one sampler. If I go back here, you will see that I can call right now directly in the other screen, that screen that is connected to the rhizome, my GUI. Okay, then the FM8, the massive, um, and for the sampler there is no GUI, you are directly accessing here. Um, I have also here in the mix bus uh, an effect, an effect tricks. So if I do play, you will see that I'm here on the patterns and I can if I want play with my patterns. Then uh, to play with that patterns, uh, I can directly chain it here, but I can use a song uh, uh, maker. What I will do for the moment is I will copy the first pattern here. I will paste it here. You can see the effect tricks here. <coughs> the effect tricks here. Then I will go back to the mixer and I will record an automation. It's one of the new features that we are presenting here for the music method. Then my effect tricks is here. I will just activate it like that and then I will do play and now you can see that it's automated so I will stop it I will go back to the sequencer like that then in that pattern my automation is recorded in that one no I just go back to the, to the pattern I select it I will call it like that. Okay, and now I go back to the sequencer. And when I will start the other pattern, I will hear it. And then now I can play between those patterns. Okay, it was just to show you that the automations are possible. If I want, I go back to the mixer and I can automate, it, automate which other parameters that can be automated all together. Now we will see on the song here that I will record a first song with my patterns who are here. I do play, I come here, I do record play. I will search 
car, another project. I will load it. You see this other project with a lot of plugins, and I will use the synchro pedal. Now on that project, I can play. the first one if I want I can directly go back to the sequencer and see my project okay now I will open Ableton Live here and actually Ableton Live is already turning then I will start the project on Ableton Live and they will be synchronized. Then, um, what I mean is, Rhizome is really different than the other machines because usually when you want to use a machine, you have the possibility to use the sounds of that machine. It's not so open as Rhizome. Rhizome can, I mean, with Rhizome you will all use what you have already in or you will design it as what you want. If you want to use it with your own plugins, if you want to use it with the native, with the F expansion and with all the great market plugins, it will be possible because it's a VST standalone sequencer. If you want also to keep your habits and to have Ableton Live installed in directly in the machine, it's possible. It's really a new generation of tool and uh, with, with that kind of tool, you don't need any mod, um, I mean keyboards, controllers, it's really an all-in-one solution. Oh, dread.